For everyone, E Monster here, back with another video today. And a few days ago, I caught a jumping spider. And it is very small, it's a baby. I caught it on our truck. And I put it in this little beta fish container from Petco. This was a beta fish I used to have. It unfortunately died. And here's the jumping spider. He's right up there. I'll try to get the focus. And I feed him ants. I just see there's ants in there. I feed him ants from outside, beetles, and other small spiders and other insects. And I've kept, I've caught a lot of spiders in the past, including jumping spiders, but they all either got away or died. And actually, the very the spider I had right before this one, I used to keep in here. It was like a house spider, and before I put it in here. It was actually living in one of my old toys, and I made a video about it. I thought it was really cool how it lived in there. So I will be uploading that video. It was made quite a while ago, but I hope you enjoy it. You might think it's ridiculous. I thought it was pretty cool, though. But unfortunately, that spider died. It lived for a long time, but then I had fed it for like a month or something, and it died. And, but here's the new spider. So I call him a few days ago. I feed him ants and stuff. I feed I was feeding him every day, but you only need to feed him like three times a week, like maybe like once on Monday, then Wednesday or then Friday, something like that. And his setup is not complete. I'm gonna be taking him out, putting him in this temporary thing. I'm gonna be putting like grass or soil at the bottom and getting a few sticks for him. So, yeah. So, that's the new edition. I got a new edition already. And I've only had Sunstrike, my bear dragon, for like three months. So, I hope you enjoy this video. And, yeah. I'm trying to get a nice shot of him. If the camera will focus. Whoa, whoa. Whoopsie. Oh, no. He fell. Oh, no. There it is. He's, he's very small. And I think these things only live for like a year. But he's still a baby. He's still very small. So I still have plenty of time to keep him. So yeah. There he goes. Ah. Uh oh. I hope I didn't mess up his web. Let's see if I can try to get his face. There he is. And if you can identify the type of species of jumping spider he is, that would be great. He's running from the ants. Whoa! Whoa! Guy's fast. Where do you go? So, yeah. That's him. So, if you can identify the species, please let me know. Because I would like to know if this is like a proper setup or whatever. Alright, so, yeah. And also, why I'm making a video, um, I have been noticing a few issues with Sunstrike's lamp. Um, so in the morning time, it, I don't think this happens every day, but in the morning time, I will turn on the lamp. And the lamp will flicker on and off, on and off, on and off. So then I turn it off for 30 seconds, turn it on again, and then it's working fine. And sometimes later in the day, if I turn it off and turn it on again, it won't even come on at all. And I noticed this when I was cleaning his tank, the last time I cleaned his tank. And I was, I was really scared for a minute. But after I finished cleaning the tank, it was working again. And... The old 50 watt lamp never did this, but I cannot switch back to that lamp because that's only UVA. He needs UVA and UVB, which is that lamp. So, comment down below if you have any concerns about this so I just not worry about it. Because for the most part, he's doing, it's doing great, the lamp's doing fine, and Sunstrike is doing excellent. But if you have any concerns, please let me know. So, thank you guys for watching.
So, they hope you guys enjoy the new addition, the new Jumping Spire. And comment down if you have any concerns about Sunstrike's rant. So, thank you guys for watching. Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. I'm E-Monster, and I'm signing off. I'm out.